Hello, uh, this is the second part of the uh, video series and what uh, will be happening now is as you can see it's uh, still installing Xmove and uh, just a little bit more information from you, uh, for you uh, Xmove is basically software which was developed uh, to help put uh, Mac OS X on a PC now it basically extracts uh, the uh, installer information all to the uh, installation partition which uh, is a lot easier than it used to be you had to, uh, you had to go through a lot of steps to get it on and with this out hopefully it's universal so if you just want a snow leopard or uh, you should be able to put it on the same way but um, I'm not sure on that I'll have to let you know if anyone wants to know just comment and I'll find out for you and uh, uh, we'll see what we can do and uh, looks like still installing Xmove at the moment should be finished soon I mean it, it doesn't take that long to install if you would also um, if you've got any questions or, or you're stuck just if you comment or you want I don't know one to one help doing it you can always add me on skype but you know, just get a comment and then ask for it. Also, what um, what are your expectations for Lion? Because uh, hopefully, it's got a nice uh, user interface. Because they. Uh, heard that they've apparently changed the um, when it's like loading or installing something you got the bars and they're like blue apparently they changed the colour like that to a lighter blue it looks really nice alright your uh, installation is almost finished now it's just running the package scripts make sure you download xmove already just download it and then you can open it when you're actually on the PC right okay that's stored now stored installed <laughs> all right just move on to the next part then I just move the camera and what you want to do is uh, reboot it but what you're going to do you're going to reboot and then uh, you're going to uh, want to go into your install installation drive so on my PC I press F F12 to get the uh, boot menu up so if you just let it turn off there we go as you can see I'm pressing uh, F12 repeatedly should get to the boot menu soon otherwise it'll just boot into our windows here we go I've got two hard drives in this right go to uh, hard disk and then I'm choosing my second drive because that's uh, primarily for OS X you just want to interrupt that if you've got a menu which loads it and you there we go you just want to click enter and go to the installer now this is where you will install Lion from. Because the Xmove you just wrote, it's you've installed it to the installer, so you can actually open Lion and then install it to uh, your Snow Leopard partition. Just let it load first. Okay, here's the welcome screen. Right, just choose your uh, language. 
obviously English for mine. Click next. Got a nice uh, background there. Press continue. And then agree. Alright, make sure you do it on your Snow Leopard drive because one of those is the Windows and one of them is uh, System Reserve. Make sure you install it to the Snow Leopard drive. And then you're just going to click install. The installation process shouldn't take too long. It only took me about, I think, 20, 20 minutes in the end. It says 36, but it, it does go down quite quickly. Right, because this uh, video is getting a bit longer, uh, I'll put it the next uh, the next part in uh, part three. Also, uh, thanks for watching, and just to remind you, I've got a website. Drop up the link below in the description. Thank you.